What's up everyone, Sarah here bringing you another daily glitch covering today's top news stories. After giving us the full reveal of the Grand Tournament card set earlier this week, Blizzard pushed out a patch set to prepare the game client for the expansion. The patch brings in some interesting tweaks focused on the upcoming game changes, including a system to track your highest earned rank in ranked play mode. A bonus chest is set to be rewarded at the end of each season based on your earned rank, so get to work! Other additions with this patch include new quests, with one focused around winning matches in Tavern Brawl mode. If you are someone who is also playing Heroes of the Storm, make sure to get in on this mode so you can earn that mount rewarded from Tavern Brawl victories. The patch also addresses other standard bug fixes you would expect. Alongside the major patch update, Blizzard officially unveiled their expansion's release date. The Grand Tournament will be arriving on August 24th. The set will bring in 132 new cards along with new mechanics. The pre-purchase period for cards is still active and will remain active until the 24th, where players will then be able to purchase the expansion card packs. As a special preview to help hype up the expansion, this week's Tavern Brawl features pre-made decks based around the expansion content, giving players a tiny taste of the action before next week's release. If you're looking for something to help pass the time while you wait for that sweet, sweet Hearthstone expansion to drop, you can always start up the New Game Plus on Witcher 3. Today marks an official drop for the final piece of free DLC, letting players restart their adventure and face new decisions, new challenges, and new adventures. The co-founder of CD Projekt Red personally reached out to thank their gamers, saying that nothing makes a developer happier than seeing gamers have fun with what they created. He goes on to express his hope that free DLC initiatives become an industry standard rather than an exception, and that The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt has set a good example for others to follow moving forward. Witcher 3 Wild Hunt set one hell of an example, in fact, of how good free DLC can be. But who knows if other devs can resist that delicious call of paid content after a game's release. We have said this before, and we will say this again, well done CD Projekt Red for going against the standard and focusing on rewarding your players. If you guys are a big fan of today's news, make sure to like the video and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. You can also subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on the top news stories each and every day. And that is The Daily Glitch.